All right, I've got a video showing you how to use your PC USB headset with um, pretty much any device that has an audio output, like a television or a games console, and so on and so forth. You get the idea. But to do this, you will need uh, <clears throat> one of these. This is a uh, red and white phono cable here, and that goes to a 3.5 millimeter kind of headphone jack. Uh, these are like three bucks, if that, and your chances are you probably already have one laying around your house. So yeah, you will need this. If you're going to use your microphone on your headset with your Xbox 360, you're going to need one of those. And this is, looks like a standard headphone uh, cable, but it's actually not. This end is two and a half millimeters. It plugs into the Xbox controller. And this one is three and a half millimeters. It plugs into your computer's speaker out. Okay, first things first, you're gonna to wanna to take the red and white end of this cable and plug it into your television's audio out. And you're gonna to wanna to plug this guy into your computer's microphone in. And if you're gonna go ahead and use your Xbox, you're gonna to wanna to plug the three and a half millimeter end of this into your computer's speaker out and obviously this end into your Xbox controller's microphone. Just a side note, if you uh, say you're using this with like an iPod, which has um, the audio out of an iPod obviously is something that looks like this, a three and a half millimeter uh, headphone jack, you're gonna want both ends to be a three and a half millimeter headphone jack then. Because one will plug into your iPod and the other will plug into your computer's uh, microphone in. All right, now I'm gonna cut over to my PC and show you what to do there. Okay, now on the computer side of things, uh, assuming you have a cord going from whichever audio output that you want to listen to into your computer's microphone in, you're going to want to go down here to the bottom right panel and you see this little speaker icon here, you're going to want to right click it and you're going to want to go to recording devices. So here uh, I have my headset microphone which I'm actually using right now and I have the microphone that's going from my television's audio out. So on this microphone that's going from whatever device you want to listen to into the computer's microphone in, you're going to want to right click, go to properties, go to the listens tab and click listen to this device. And you're going to want to listen to it through your uh, USB headset speakers. So you just apply that and hit OK. I'm not going to do that right now because um, well, this is just an example. And that's uh, well, that's actually pretty much it. If you just want to listen to a, a simple audio device or your video games through your PC headset, uh, if you want to go ahead and hook up your Xbox so that you can use your microphone, you're going to want to stay in this panel. And you're going to want to right click the microphone, your microphone on your headset, and go to properties, then go to listen, then listen to this device, and listen through your speakers. I have a lot of options here, but just you're just going to want to listen through whichever device is your audio output on your computer or your laptop. Laptop is a computer. Whatever. Anyway, once you've done that, I'm not going to do that again. This is an example. You just apply and click OK. And yeah, that's pretty much almost it. So you're just going to want to click OK on this window here. I would do want to make like a bit of a side note. I have uh, some Dolby Digital Theater crap that came with my motherboard, and I notice that whenever it's on, and I'm in an Xbox Live party chat, uh, people are telling me there's some weird crap going on with my voice, so I just simply like disable that or right, right here. Yeah, so if you have any kind of audio effects um, going on, you may want to disable them just to make things a little easier and make sure that there's no interference or whatever. And uh, all that's left to do is switch over to my Xbox and show you what to do there. Okay, so at your Xbox, you're going to want to go ahead and hit the center button. And you're going to want to go over to Preferences. Then you're going to want to go to the Voice Settings. And set it to play through speakers only. Do not play it through both. There is an echo and people will get mad. Or at least people get mad at me. So yeah, just set it to play through speakers because um, typically the if you plug in an Xbox controller's headset 
when it plugs into the controller, it both takes audio in and uh, outputs audio, which is the other people talking to you, obviously, all through that one headset. This, obviously, this setup does not do that. So you have to set it to play through your speakers because your computer is actually listening to your speakers. All right, and really, that's it. So any questions, just ask them in the comments section. And yeah.